I'm Cole Coleman, and I'm in the inventor of the thimble slide guitar slide, and that's uh, that's my product. That's what I manufacture uh, in Los Angeles, California. Oh, cool! And it's the slide that allows you to be able to slide and fret. You, you can still press the strings while you're wearing it, so you can actually still play the guitar, fretting, and then you can go slide and go right back to fretting. And um, that's what I do. Awesome. Yeah. Very cool. So, what got you? Uh, what got you involved in doing something like this? Professional musician for over 20 years, but I had this idea since I was about 18 years old. Oh, wow. And when I was first playing in bars and was called upon to do slides, and you know, you'd, you'd pop the uh, standard slide on, and it's just so cumbersome and awkward, and it's unable to use that finger anymore. You, you put a regular slide on, it's like putting a splint on. So I always had this idea that it really should be shorter, and it just I just figured that some big company was going to do it. You know, it's yeah. like Dunlop or some other company. Do it. Yeah, so, 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 so 20 years goes by. And I'm like still playing on the circuits, and I'm going to stores, and nobody really has one. I've tried knuckle slides, but knuckle slides are the same size at both ends, so they're still kind of loose. Yeah. My, 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 my thimble slide is, is larger at one end and smaller at the other, right. so, so it follows the contour of your, of your finger. So it's tight. It, it, it's not loose at all. And having it that way allows your, your other fingers to get close, so you can, you can get in close, play the chords, play right. lines. And that was it. So after 20 years of looking around for someone else to do it, no one was, so I figured, you know, maybe I better have a go at it. Sure, that's great. Yeah. So I started by getting a ring. I got a large biker ring. It was a silver biker ring. And I took a hacksaw to it, and I cut it down to the right to the right angles. And it worked so well, I, I showed it to a couple of guitar player friends of mine, and they're like, dude, you might have something here, you know? Yeah. That's so great, that, man. Yeah, that was it. Now, now development took years. It's like, it's like oh, sure. yeah, I, I thought for sure I could get it done in about a year, maybe two. But in reality, it took about three years of prototyping to, to get to get everything to work right. Right. Yeah. Because I know there's grooves in, in yeah. there as well, right? Exactly, exactly. So does that help you shape like the size or whatever else? That's it. And the, the grooves on the outside are really just decoration. But on the inside, there's also grooves. I, I call those the sizing grooves. And they act really kind of like a hinge. So when I, when I size them, so you see there's a sizing gap down the top, and that allows me to make it a little smaller or a little bit larger. But the grooves on the inside allow the, the wall to fold in like a yeah. hinge, uh, li 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 leaving the bottom alone. So that's, great. so that's why they're there. Very cool, man. Yeah. Thanks, man. Well, like, yeah, it was really comfortable on my finger. It felt it's a little weird at first getting used to it, but I mean, I think it's going to work good. You know, if you're that, if you play a lot of in between kind of stuff. Yeah, some, some people take to it right away and, and require very little like adjustment. Other people takes a little longer to get used to. Right. But like, uh, like there's a guitar player out there called uh, Thomas Blug. Oh yeah, I saw yeah. him last year. Where is he here? No, no, I met him in Germany. I was at the uh, Music Message show. Yeah, I saw him at the Nam show last year, and uh, I haven't seen him this year though. Yeah, no, he was he was jamming at a booth playing like a phenomenal player, and I said, Hey Thomas, try my slide out, and, he, and he's like, Dude, I don't I don't play slide. I said, Yeah, just give it a try. He popped it on his finger, and luckily it fit right away, right? Right. And within like 10 seconds, the guy was like just wailing away with yeah. it. It was amazing. And after about a minute of that, he turned over his shoulder and goes, dude, I got to have this thing. I love it. Right. Hey, man, you're sold. That's good. So That's yeah, cool. he's, he's a phenomenal player. Well, thanks for uh, talking with me today at the NAMM show, and uh, safe travels back, OK? Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you. Hey, hey, hey. Wait a second, before you go, be sure to check out the description down below. There's a lot of really cool links. And definitely be sure to check out my website, DrMcFarlandStudios.com. See ya.